satisfied with your life? This can seem a really strange question, and an even stranger one might be where you get your satisfaction from. For a lot of people, it's gained by achieving their personal goals, or maybe through relationships with friends and family, um, but this isn't something you really think about, is it? I was raised by Christian parents, but this, frankly this was far from what I was happy with. I just wasn't sure about all these supposed rules, trying to govern what I should and shouldn't do. I was really sure that this is not what was going to satisfy me in the end and get me where I wanted to go. When I was in school, my friends and I began actively searching for satisfaction in our lives. And this came in various forms. We discovered the attention which could be gained for dressing in a certain way, or a confidence that could only be gained after a couple of drinks. Or even a self-esteem boost from the attention of a guy. And if you weren't getting this attention, there was probably something wrong with you. Soon I found myself yearning for the attention and satisfaction I could get in those things. And just, uh, I began to create the attention and love that this might finally explain me and make me feel a bit more whole. But this is something I could never do, as I learned. When I was 16, I properly heard the Christian message. In this, I found a God who not only loved me far more than I could ever comprehend, but wanted a relationship with me. A relationship that would satisfy me more than anything of this world ever could. A God who promises to be there through the pain and the suffering, and a love that is certain and everlasting. Whether it be the satisfaction we think we might gain through relationships, through wealth, or through achievements, it's hard to imagine now that I could ever be satisfied with anything less than the Creator God. A God that loves me, a God that cares for me, and a God that sent His Son to die for me. Take me away to some place real. Right, let's go. Shut up.